Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming, where today we are continuing our Sparta campaign. I believe we're on episode 27. Now, last time we set out our defensive tactics, as well as defending against the goddamn Pergamons. Um, and we need to defend against the Ptolemies very soon, which I believe we will use this army for, hopefully. Um, good defensive army, very nice defensive army. You know, we'll use Seuss. I think Seuss is a good option as a defensive general because he's reasonably old and not brilliant. He's only got five stars compared to some of our younger people, say Uimon, who's 33 and got 10. So we've got a defensive strategy sorted. We also have this defensive army up here to the northeast, ready to defend against the goddamn uh, Bosprins, if they come. We'll also have another defensive army, most likely someone else, probably not Eatrocles, who will defend up in around a Quincum. Um, whether we need a general for that is another question. Uh, but we have plenty of armies retraining. We've got about three armies ready to retrain right now. Uh, so we've got loads of armies ready for retraining. I'm going to be sending more and more across the sea towards Rome to finally bring them to heal. Now, at this end turn, I believe we will most definitely get attacked by this army, which is a pretty scary army, not going to lie. The Romans are always very scary, no matter how many troops you fight. But I'm hoping, seeing as we're backed up against this mountain, we might get a nice defensive bonus here. We might get a nice defensive area, but we shall see anyway. Um, anyway, guys, while I press the end turn, please do check out my new video Okay, so they let go of the siege and attacked again. That's brilliant for us. <laughs> that is excellent for us. Fantastic. Thank you, uh, Ptolemies. Yeah, it's going to be another two turns before they can't attack. Fantastic. Um, please do check out my new video where we got a little bit of a sneak preview of the next update to the glorious RTR Imperium Serectum. Cannot wait uh, for you guys to watch that. I hope you enjoy it. Please do watch it. You'll see the new map. It's absolutely ginormous and stunning at the same time. Plenty of updates to the mod to come in the future, so do check that out. I mean, I don't know how this is uh, evenly matched, but again, we will just defend. There's no need to do anything else, is there? So we will just defend, and we are backed up against that mountain, hopefully. We've got to attack from that side. So we'll just back up in the middle, hopefully. Anyway, guys, I will see you on the battle map. Here we are. Oh, come on. Look at this. This is not the battle map we were hoping for. Why do we always end up at the bottom of a hill? Like, why are we at the bottom? Those are the mountains I wanted. Please. Why do they get the fucking hill again? Pricks. Fucking Romans, man. Hate them. Right. Let us... I mean, there's nowhere good to set up either because of the trees. As we know, trees are pretty hard to set up well on. We will use this ridge, though. We're going to have to. There's not really any other options for us, is there? So, set up here. I'm thinking one of their units will be coming in from this side. But I'm hoping, hoping we can hold them off. A lot of these guys will probably be hidden. At least I think so. Uh, let's just organize these guys a little bit more. I think maybe further down the hill. Out there. And then these guys up here. And we can get this... Oh, no, you're not a ballista, my friend. Ballista probably like there. You guys there. Hoping that'll do. It's, it's good enough, anyway. Let's just see what they do. That's going to be the main thing. Get a midi loss up here as well. There you are, my friend. You can see the whole battlefield. And they're actually coming from different directions. That's great. Uh, we'll leave them to maneuver themselves around. They, a bit pointless, aren't they? Doing this. Get firing. 
And probably, in terms of the manoeuvring, we probably just want to move up the hill more so we close off this space. That's the edge of the map, so uh, good luck to them getting around that way. Uh, we'll move our archers potentially more this way as well. Midi loss come this way. Let's make sure that they're not. Okay. So, looks like we need to stop our guys moving now. Where did we put them? So, let's uh, try and stop them. Get in position, boys. They're coming back. F quick, in position. So, I want to run them just nice and slowly. Get ready to receive the charge, my boys. Hoping they'll be ready. Come on. Yeah, they're just about ready. Oh, he's dead already. Nice. And he's broken. Fantastic. Well done, boys. Why? Why are you doing this? Go. And remember to always put your archers on guard mode, guys. Otherwise, they end up doing stupid stuff like that. We have those three over there. Those three there. Don't know which one of those three is the one that's in the city. Can't quite remember. Keep firing. Look at that position. That is a lovely position. It's mainly Prinkapes and Hastati. I don't see Triarii anywhere, which is good for us because the Triarii, of course, excellent unit. Very hard to beat. Come on. Kill as many as you can. I hate the fact that they can push through like that. Still annoys me. Look at that. Look how many have died in this push. They should not be able to just run through there like that. Makes no sense. <laughs> Horse is just running through a phalanx. Fantastic. You've taken some damage as well. So have you guys. That's great. Now... This side, we're pretty good to uh, go and attack because there isn't anyone covering this side. How about down here? I mean, they've got those guys. What I might do... Let's uh, just retreat back up there a bit. Let's get these guys. Get these guys walking through here. Let's get these guys down this way. Come on, boys. Get rid of those goddamn equites. You guys, let's halt you so you get your phalanxes out once again. And let's get into the back of that prinker base. Come on, boys. Get you up there. Good. Just keep on coming. No, not attack order. Let's just walk. Cycle these charges. Broke them. Nice. Nice to see that. Everyone's a bit shaken. Now out, boys. How far? Oh, we want to probably come across this way. How's this other army coming? They're there. Good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just halt, guys. Halt. They've got to be, you've got a bit too extreme there, I've got to say. Get back, cavalry, get back. Ballista's taken a huge amount of damage there. So is one of our archers. How are you through the middle there? I'll get you out, middle loss. We don't want you to die, my friend. Whoa. Okay, Javis. Not good. Actually, screw these guys. Don't throw Javis at me. We're cavalry. We're faster than you. Ah, oh, goddamn. We're kind of a bit stuck here. Let's go into there. Oh, they do have Triarii. Why are some of you so slow? 
Come on. Get moving. Now let's move you up here. Get you out of the fight. And we'll try and bring you rack round this way. Get across that way, guys. Come on. Go, 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 go. Okay, that's one of our units. Got a bit scared. Come on. God damn annoying some of these uh, maneuvers. Well, what have we got over here? That's fine. Get over there, my boys. Where are they going? Why are they coming around this way? Let's uh, get you guys in reserve. See, okay, so you guys in phalanx mode. No, why? Stop. You need to realize you need to be in phalanx all the time. You guys there. You guys there. Okay, interesting. Starty. Go, move. Come in. Oh, god damn, these guys are broken. God damn it. Forward, keep moving forward a bit. There we are. Now halt. Yep, cool. God, this is taking a lot more damage than I was expecting. Get in the back of them. We need to kill that general, really. Guys, over that way. Right, Cav. Do some damage for me. Looks like you did nothing. Great. <laughs> you idiots. Halt. There. Get there. Come on. Ah, maneuvering these guys is hard sometimes, bro. No, don't attack. Oh, cavalry! I told you to get out and you didn't! You fools! Halt them. I think we lose it. I, I don't think we're going to lose, but... We're going to lose so many troops that I don't think it's viable for us to do... Oh my god, what are you doing? <laughs> that is a mess. It's a glorious mess. This way, guys. Halt. Just halt. Just set up. Okay, we broke a couple of those units, though, doing that. So let's come around again. Let's see whether we can break someone else. God, this is this is brutal. So get you there, and then you protect that flank. Uh, hmm. My midi loss. Get up there. The rest of you. You guys, we need to halt. Get in position. Let's go. Ah, oh, this is so messy. This is what happens when, when phalanxes just don't hold. Everything becomes a serious, serious mess. Get them. Okay, they're coming now. Set up there. And just halt. Big blob there. I wish I had my cavalry. Let's go. Okay, this is better now. Weird position to be in, but it's better. Right, midi loss. Let's come round. You guys start pushing these guys. A halt. Now kill them. Well, that's what we like to see. Surround them. Surround the fools. 
Okay, we broke that guy. Good. Come on. Ah, oh, this was a brutal battle. God, we lost more than half our men. Now out, boys. Yeah, I don't think we can take that big army anymore. We needed a better defensive position, really. Kill that Hastati. Oh, they lost a lot of men in that charge. Obscene amount of men, actually. So I'm hoping with this shaken because their general's running away, we can break them. Yes, come on. Now out. Come on, Cav. You're all I've got left. Oh, I've got nothing left. Mass route. Let's go. Okay, that was tough. It was a tough battle. Really tough, in fact. Who's not routing, then? It's hard to tell between the Roman and the uh, Spartan banners, honestly. Who's not routing? Okay. Cool. That's one general dead. Get okay, uh, you guys there. Midi lost. You go after them. You guys after these guys. And let's speed it up. Whew. God, a lot tighter than I was expecting, honestly. You three... Get you down there. And you after them. Let's get up to there. It says they don't have many, but I don't trust that fully. Oh god, we lost a lot of a lot of our cavalry to our own archers there, I'd say. That was stupid of me. God damn it! Anyway. <laughs> what a tough battle, eh? Kill as many as you can. They deserve it. Ah, oh, tougher than I was expecting. But you've got to remember how good these Roman troops are. Like they started with about thirteen hundred, we started with fifteen hundred. You've got to remember those Roman troops, one for one, are so much better than every other kind of unit in the game. Really, cavalry doing damage. Ah, uh, phalangites. Some of them doing atrociously. These guys. Uh, these guys doing terribly. Not doing great. That was the first battle with the Phalangites where I felt like we were outmatched. But they just maneuvered better. And somehow they can just push through a Phalanx formation half the time. So I think I really do need to start keeping two behind. Uh, just in case. Anyway, we'll see you on the uh, campaign map, guys. And probably another Roman battle straight away. Here we are, guys. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. Please, can we take Capua? <laughs> I wish we could retreat into Capua. Well, let's retreat anyway. Okay, they're attacking anyway. Oh, no. Is this where Midilos dies? I should have done a long retreat. Why would they go for the battle, the night battle as well? This is going to require some hug boxing, guys. And I'm sorry for that, but it's the only way we keep this army alive, honestly. So, uh... <laughs> Midilos is going to learn the art of uh, invisible maps. Uh, invisible uh, edges to the map. <laughs> That's the only way we're going to keep that army alive. And I, I want to keep it alive. So, I'll see you on the battle map, guys. Here we are, guys. Very flat map. Um, yeah, courage and honor. It's one way of putting <laughs> putting our, our new exploits of hug boxing. Um, but yeah, it's it's literally the only way we survive this. So I don't like I I normally don't like cheesing the game, but in this particular situation, we will. <laughs> I've done it a couple of times in the campaign. I've not done it excessively. I don't like to do it excessively, but a couple of times is fine, okay? A couple of times is fine. So, I wish I could see the edges of the map. It's probably there to stop people hugboxing, honestly. It's about there. So, it's about there. To here. I think that's about it, really. Um, so, nah, you don't need to run, guys. 
This is going to take a bit of fine tuning. The edge of the map is there. So, let's try and get even in even in even closer. It's right there. So this is right the corner where I am now and I'm looking up the map. That way. It's about yeah, so I'm looking straight up it now, so I'm thinking there. I'm gonna overlap all these boyos as well, of course. There we are. Let's make sure we get to the end of the map. Um it's actually too too much. Sorry, too little. We need to come across more harshly or, or further down. Go there. You guys are in the middle, so you're a nice and fat one. This is just obscenely <laughs> gamey, but honestly, to save my army, boys, I will. Uh, I would gladly sacrifice my own dignity. Uh, actually, the, the wait. What's this cavalry doing? Uh, so we're gonna get one fat one over there. You guys there. You guys there. Is that everyone? Ballista, come behind. Oh, you won't even fit in there. Missile boys, get in there. Cavalry. Luckily, the cavalry, there's like none of them. Get middle loss out there. You boys in there. I don't I don't even know whether this will work, honestly. That's the problem. We do have U44 as a reserve. So, thinking we uh, like put you behind here, maybe. I won't even see my troops. I'll have to look at them. <laughs> Oh, glorious! Make sure we're all in phalanx mode now, boys. Should all be slightly overlapping. Yeah. You're a bit fatter. You guys overlapping a bit more, ideally. You guys overlapping quite a lot. Quite like you guys there, honestly. And then you guys right on this side. Uh, it's probably like that. Well, nope. Nope, 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 nope. That's exactly not what I wanted to do. You guys now... In the sides. Okay, what is that? Tarantine Cavalry. Throwing their javis. Oh, well. Hopefully we don't hit our own men. Midialos, you come there, my friend. I can't even see the rest of their army now. It's going to come over the hill soon enough. Not on a... Well, we could fire all the way over there, could we? That's weird. Ah, oh, look at this. Look at this! Ah, <laughs> oh, I am willing to sacrifice my honor to save this army. I hope you're happy, Midalos. I hope you're happy. It's not the greatest of hug boxes I've ever seen, but... It's something. This one, this bit's just a bit thin. So, probably need to fatten it up a bit. Right there. Okay, that's better. That's a nice... Okay, here the boys come. Come on, Romans. They've already wasted 10 minutes of the battle doing this. Which is great. Great for us. We're going to try and push one side. That's fine. I haven't seen us losing any troops from our archers yet. Because we're firing up the hill, which is good. So here they come. 
some Triarii as well. Ugh. Do they have to lead the charge? They're too good. Wait, archers, why? Archers! What what are they doing? Why? How dumb can you be, bro? Set them all onto guard mode. I don't know why they decided to do that. Oh, they're on uh that's why. They ran away. Idiots, man. They're gonna fuck up our plans here. Well, hello, Romans. How do you like my hug box, sir? I mean, that's the one problem is... Uh, we're going to get absolutely hammered by Javis. It's the only way we can survive this. There's not really anything else we can do. Have to pray. Hope and pray. Once they fight their Javis, they'll charge us. Oh, look at that. That, that area is very, very thin. I think we get midi loss in here. Or do we get this guy? I think we get this guy. So run. Just come here first. So you're not getting involved in any other fights. And then there. And in phalanx. In phalanx. And I want you to go there. Alright, so keep on halting our boyos. Keep making sure they're in phalanx formation. Midi lost my boy. I'm going to have to come and protect this flank. We're going to have to send everyone in, aren't we? Cav, get that Hastati. See, they're just like pushing through the phalanx, which is just... I don't think that should be possible, bro. Midi loss, get a bit of a rally off. Why can I not tell them to halt? I can't tell them to do anything. Can't tell any of them to halt, that's weird. This left side is just crumbling. Unfortunately. How can they just push through the phalanx like that? Anyway, let's speed it up because there's nothing else we can do. How many did we... We've killed no one. Well, that's great as well. Gonna lose our whole army and kill no one. Everyone halt. Especially you boys. This side held fine. This left flank was a different story. Get one rally off before you die. Ah, oh, god damn it, bro. Ah, the Romans. Everyone else run, and we might get a long retreat. Halt. Everyone's gone. Good, good. We might get a long retreat. We didn't even inflict more casualties than them. God damn it, bro. Ah, oh, well, that the strategy didn't work, because they can, for some reason, just able to just push through a, a pike wall which <laughs> makes no sense <laughs> oh god damn it anyway i'll see you on the campaign map guys here we are and uh, instantly into a battle with uh, romans roman ships so where did we retreat to i didn't see it so he took capua back that's fine oh wait we took asanka without even fighting uh, let's go for the enslavement there, I think. Low. Oh, God. They are not happy. I'm happy, honestly, to not uh, repair this army. I'd repair the cavalry. I'm going to take the cavalry for retraining. I'll take it back to Bylazora, I believe. Because Bylazora can... Oh, cannot recruit those troops. So let's uh, go back to Pella. Let's uh, go that way. rest of you guys... Let's build something that will make you happy. Not that. I will not make you happy. Got Hezbelis, Rosmerta, and Bendis. Bendis is for missile weapons. I'm happy to keep that. 
Should I keep the tavern? I think so. We'll make him into a drunkard. I mean, he is on defensive duty, so... He's probably going to be pretty upset. <laughs> but this... I'm happy to just keep these guys as our defensive army. I think they'll do a good enough job defending down here. Go on, Sirakis. Go and have your fun. Wherever you want to go, I'm happy. Okay. You, uh, Melus, the handsome. He's sober. Mildly extravagant. Godlike perfection. Adonis would gaze upon this man with jealousy. Really? Okay. Fair enough. Restrained. Uh, understanding of tactics. A casual adulterer. Oligarch and publicly loyal. Okay, cool. Well, I think he'll be a pretty good candidate for our next army. So we'll try and take him backwards when we can. Now, I need to find where we went. We went here. Okay, interesting. I think out of all... Hmm. We have these guys. Okay, yeah, these guys were getting dropped off up at Ancona, weren't they? Let's drop them off and get in the dock. You... Guys are going to get on the boat. You're going to stay in there for the time being. Cool. Now, you guys. Where were you going? You were going to go and get more crypts here, weren't you? So this army is going back for retraining. This army is going after Ascalum. Okay, they've got some big armies out and about now. Two huge armies. We need to remove you from Malaventum ASAP. So we'll leave the crypt here there. And we'll get down to these docks. We need more ships. Where are our other ships? This navy is going to be invaluable. Let's get them across. Oh, wait, they've still got time. Wait, we, we got defeated there. What? God damn it, bro. Really? Well, that's very annoying. Um... What do we do with you? Do we just go and move two armies at the same time? I mean, I think that's the play, really. Because of these two huge armies they've got down there. Or do we go straight for Rome? No, we, we can't do that. I think we move two at the same time. So you guys, where are you going? You were going to go pick up more Cryptia, weren't you? Get them there. Get them there. Or were you going to pick up a new army? Can't quite remember. So let's send over you guys with your new cavalry. Get there. Come there. So you guys are the defensive army for over here. So you're going to go defend. Oh, no, you're not. Oh, yeah, you are. You guys are going in Lysomachia. Nice little bit of a defensive force. Send you guys over. You guys are getting retrained. Cool. Everyone. Good. Cleonimos, you keep coming down, my friend, don't you? Need more soldiers and we need more cavalry. Ah, we just need more armies to fight Rome, because these two massive armies have just come out of nowhere. They're going to be tough to fight. Really tough to fight. Hmm. We all of a sudden look quite weak. Okay, they can't get past... Okay, he can catch, but I think if we do one retreat, we'll be out of the way. And I don't think he'll be able to catch us. That's good. Cool. So we've taken a Sanka. Our cavalry's gone back. I think we'll take some of this crypt here if we can out of Dark Adava. Yeah, we can. So they'll come up to a Sanka to garrison it. We need to make them happy again, though, for a second. Um, over this way. We're good. Where are you going, Demeter? Where were you going? Are you going to Tyras? Think of better places to uh, have a leader. Probably Thomas would be even better. Hmm. 
I think Thomas. I think Thomas is a decent place for uh, governor, honestly. Or do we use you to uh, culture convert some of these places? So let's see which ones don't have our culture. Well, Thomas doesn't. So we'll start with Thomas. So seeing as it's uh, not got anything to uh, build, we'll build that there. Uh, rioting in Lysa Marke, uh That's fine. We'll repair there. And we're actually not rioting anymore. Serakis have arrived. That's cool. Byzantium still under siege. Coming of age. Eumelus the Handsome is actually a pretty decent general with that plus two morale. Cool. Cool, cool. Bit of a scramble this turn, but we're still fine. Athens has now got the aqueduct. We go for... We're pretty stable on money, but... If we're going to ramp up our military production, let's ramp up our monetary production as well in some of these larger cities. So let's go for the Merchant's Quarter in Corinth as well. Then Orchomenos. The thing is, they cost a lot of money, so it looks like our money's going down, but we're actually investing for the future. Orchomenos. Hmm. We do have a governor here, so I'm happy to build that scriptorium. Larissa, we also just built the scriptorium. What do we want here? Let's go down the Zeus line. We've not really done that very many times, have we? And Brachia, we just want military buildings, really. But we can't. So let's go for population growth. Try and get it to a huge city. Um, which one's better? I mean, they're both pretty good. But Aqueduct takes is a, is a quicker one. So we'll go for Aqueduct first. Thessalonica. Just keep on going down that line. Nisus, Nisus, hmm, I mean, Nisus isn't that important, really, let's go for that, Salona got the large temple of Hera, hmm, I tell you what, Salona's quite a good forward construction, uh, army construction place, because of the armor up. But we only have level, we have like no levels in that, so let's not bother about army for Salona then. Thomas, we're already building that. A Quincum, build those mines. Let's get some military buildings up in this place. Suggestica, so let's go for that dockyard. Or we could go for the walls. Uh, let's go for the walls. This is a defensive place for us. Malaventum, we got the stone walls. That's That's excellent. We go straight for the large stone walls, I think. Uh, Venusia, because there is a big difference. Let's go for the paved roads in Venusia. Lysomachia, yeah, we're building those walls. Brilliant. Okay, cool. So let's just check we're doing everything right. So this army also needs retraining. We already have an army in Pella for retraining, so you're going to have to join the queue. <laughs> God, the queue of armies for retraining, hey? Uh, was there any... Of our lovely Thessalonian Thessalian Lancers, there is one. So you can go for Mylazora. Get your upgrades. We will use you. Fantastic. Cleonimos. Uh, look at some of these units. They're decently experienced in Cleonimos's army. Some of these as well. Very good. Protus's army. Been on the road for some time. How about these armies across here? We need to start building a navy as well. So let's uh, let's do that. Let's uh, build some uh, ships in some of these places. I don't want the Quinkareems because they're too slow. Building there. Argos, Triremes. Athens we're constructing. It's Triremes. Triremes for everyone. Thermon, you can go by, oh, Thermon's already building. Well, we'll build uh, around there. That'll be fine. Um, hopefully, that'll put the uh, Romans off from attacking our navies. God, look at these guys. Appius, so Lucinus and a Scipio. Oh, God, not the Scipios. <laughs> we don't want to fight those goddamn Scipios. Not anytime soon, anyway. I think we've got a decent enough army up there. It's predominantly made up of these Bastanian swordsmen and mercenary falcsmen, which are actually not too not too bad because they are 
AP, they're armor piercing. So, pretty decent units, really. So, we've got a pretty uh, big mercenary army up here. Might as well get you guys in there as well. This army is just a mercenary haven. Full of them. Full of mercenaries. We'll kill them all. It's Dolon. So, Dolon, we might as well leave in my Mytonium my while... Uh, there's no point leaving him in a fort. He might as well govern somewhere. And it's Greek as well, Dolon. Very good. Not Sorry, Mytonium is not Dolon. <laughs> Dolon's Greek, definitely. Uh, so, Venusia. Good. I think we're in a decent position once again. Once we've got uh, these armies ready, we'll use Eumus, Eumius, or whatever the hell he's called, the Handsome. <laughs> so, let's end the turn. But we do want we do want cavalry generals ideally. Cavalry generals will be very ideal. Oh come on, Carthage! Ah, god damn it! God damn it! Ah, Suebi as well. Everyone, wait, where did that army come from? Oh, those are the uh, crypt here. So they're just walking across past the Quincum. They're not bothered. Oh, they got beaten back by the Serakis. <laughs> Fantastic. That's good to see. Assassin! No, don't you dare. Okay, good. And Pergamon comes back as well. Oh, we're under pressure. Pushing down on me. Pushing down on you. Pushing down on Sparta. Under pressure. Oh, my God. Pressure, pressure everywhere. Ah. Oh. So Asanka, Lysimachia, Tarentum, and Byzantium. Great. Sparta has grown eventually. We get that in first because it might not grow if we try and re recruit some more stuff. As if they have betrayed us as well. So now we have two enemies to worry about. The, the one thing though is... Um, I'm pretty sure we'll beat that Carthaginian army quite easily. Don't think we need to worry about it. You guys get drop you off. Oh, come on, boat. Get in the docks. Thank you. Get in there and stay there. Cool. Should have dropped the other guys off as well. So what do we not have? It's more infantry we need. So let's get some of these guys from Umbrakia. Up to Bylazora for retraining. So, have we retrained this army yet? Nope. Not fully. One more turn, though. Oh, God. There's a lot of armies down here that need retraining, guys. <laughs> there's a queue. I think we should be able to retrain them in Embrachia. So, why don't we just send you guys straight there. Should be able to get retrained here. And you're actually closer to the border. Well, they want to keep training them. So. Yep. Yep, we'll retrain. So we can train, retrain two armies at the same time. You go to Ambrakia next then. Because we've got a queue, haven't we, over here? So we've got this army that's coming down here. I think we deal with the, uh, the Ptolemaeus first. Then we'll go after Pergamon. We've still got a couple of turns for Pergamon, so that's fine. The Suebi up here, I'm, I'm happy to let them attack us. That's fine. That's our defensive army there. They won't be able to break our phalanxes, unlike the Romans, I'm pretty sure. Uh, the Serakis can just do what they want. I'm not bothered by that. Is there anywhere up here that we can re recruit cavalry? Because I'll, I'll just retrain them up here if there is. No. Quincum? Wait, a Quincum can't. Signum. Nisus. How about Salona? No. Retrain those boys, though. Get another one. Uh, well, we know a Quincum can, so we'll come around that way. Oh, we might get attacked by that guy. Oh, whatever. We'll just have to send more cavalry up that way. That's fine. So over here... What are we doing? We want to take that. I'm pretty sure I'm going to just auto-resolve this. 
Shouldn't result in any deaths, really. What? Guys, 870. No way. Well, I'm exterminating for that. Jesus Christ, alive. That's just silly. <laughs> well, I'm going to stand here because that means that that guy can't get to us. Or he can try, but there'll be two armies to fight. Oh, god damn it, bro. I'm thinking we go for... I'm going to go for Eretium. I want to surround Rome, really. I mean, we need to destroy these armies, though, more than anything. Can't just keep not fighting them. There's this as well. God damn it, bro. So when this army's done, they need to get straight across to Tarentum to fight the Carthaginians. We need to go and take Regium and defend Regium. They've got another full stack army here, which is actually of better troops, it looks like. Hmm... This is something we really didn't need. God damn, bro. Well, let's go for this battle first. So, what we're going to do, we'll do this battle, we'll probably end the turn there. So, we're going to end there, make sure everything's right with everything else. Uh, so, what did he get? He got a runner. That's good. More command. Iceni and Suebia at war. Bosporans and the Armenia. God damn. AI, man. Don't attack your own allies just because they neighbor you. It's the whole point of allies, bro. <laughs> Let's go for irrigation at Megalopolis. Argos. Let's go for irrigation as well. Rhodes. It really doesn't matter. Uh, Bylazora. Let's go for... Shrine Tahira, I'd probably say. And Oiskos. Wait, let's go back to Bylazor and look at the uh, recruitment. Ah. Can't retrain any of those. So the extra awesome Temple of Daimos and Phobos did nothing. Really need to get this to a uh, huge city. So instead of that, we need the aqueduct, don't we? Need whatever gives us population growth. Hmm. Oiskos. Let's go for... Oiskos gets the armor as well. Whatever. Build that. The Yarda. No, it doesn't matter. Just build whatever. Arrestia, we've got the paved roads. That's good. Let's go for that dockyard. Extra money. Dark Yadava. Go for the sewers. Uh, Tyras. Let's go for shipwrights. Croton, go for the public baths, Mytonium, let's go for the paved roads, we're losing a lot of money here, and Sanka, Sanka's back to being happy, so that's good, ah, right, so we've done everything we need to in terms of mo moving the armies, etc, apart from you, right, an offensive battle, Oh, against the Egyptians. Uh, let's go, guys. Let's go. I'll see you on the battle map. Tonight, we will feast and drink. Tonight, we will tell Here we are. Okay. That, I don't care, okay? I just want to fight this goddamn battle. Get rid of these guys. Guys, that side. You guys, that side. So let's group you boys up and spread them out a bit more. Right now we've got the Seuss to deal with. Oh wait, there's another guy. Group him in. Another guy. Cool. Archers. Get you in there. And cavalry either side. Yep, whatever. What are they doing? This is news Let's go forward. Let's try and squeeze them. Put the squeeze on them. Let's go. Wait, wait. What's happening there? Why were two of them not going? Get 
there, archers. Left hand guy, let's get you there. Right hand guy, let's get you there. Seuss, let's go. Cav, go. God, micro. So much micro. We can like fully surround them here if we want to. Just going straight for the kill, boys. Let's go. Everyone. Into Phalanx as soon as we get in there as well. Into that Phalanx. And let's go. Walk through them. These guys there. Let's get Seuss up. Cavalry, let's go. Cavalry, let's go. You, let's go. Let's go that way. Let's get fully surround them. Oh, hello. Oh, I'll get through that way. And you can go that way. What are you doing? Halt! What are you doing? Get them. Let's get them. Let's get there. Get them. The pissy light. Fuck the pissy light. You boys, let's halt. You boys. Get into those Theroperite. Shaken. Well, oh, I'm hoping they'll break now. Steady. So let's come out. Get all you guys up there. Let's go. Let's go through this way. Let's get you in a big fat formation. Are you boys there? What's that unit doing here? Halt, guys. Halt. Get the back of that Theroperoite. Let's get you squishing in here. Move in. Let's go. You guys are over here. Let's get you there. Surely they're going to break now. Uh, how are they not broken? Keep coming. And you guys keep coming as well. Now halt. Got them fully surrounded here. Just poor guys. Let's get them. Wait, one of our guys is broken. But that's okay. It's that way. Oh, you're not in phalanx. That's why. Now into the back of them. Oh, look at this. Okay, this is uh, interesting. Get you out, boy. Get you out. Seuss is down to his last man. Cavalry. Need to get you in there. Fight the Agama. Okay, we're doing decently. Did a quite decent job of surrounding them there. We had a couple of units get a lot of damage, but mostly we were good. I think that's good. Right, let's go after them. Let's make sure they can never come back. Those boys. Phalanx of the Kalorichoi. Kill them. Uh, archers wise, let's uh, not not fire anymore. 
Send them away. Yep, kill them all. How many did we kill? Hoping we've destroyed that whole army, but we shall see. Kill them. Nice. Well done. Well done, guys. Well done. Fantastic. Ah, that was nice. Nice to get back into uh, having a good victory. Cavalry doing absolute bits. These guys did took a, take a lot of damage, but it was that standard push again. They managed to push through us. Uh, anyway, I'll see you back on the campaign map, guys. Here we are, guys. I'm pretty sure we fully destroyed them. So we move towards Lysomachia to defeat Harmon. Mr. Harmon over here. So we'll fight him. In terms of damage, there's only three units that have really taken a lot of damage. The rest will form a very strong front line still. And the cavalry is still in decent shape. So that's very helpful indeed. Um, could we just like... How are they getting across there? Like, Which way do they go? Is it there? It must be there. If we just went like... There. Does it stop them? Does that stop them from coming across? I don't, I, I'm not sure. Hmm. Enemy army routes. What has he got? Superior commander now, Seuss. That's good. That's decent. That's good to see. Uh, once this army's done, you're going straight to fight the Carthaginians. Hopefully you can beat both of those armies. I mean, this one doesn't look particularly good. This one looks a lot better, but again, not excellent. No cavalry, really, to see. So, that should be fine. It's these big Roman armies that we really, really need to take out. So, hoping we do so with you and a new army as well. Because this one, again, needs retraining because of that auto-resolve. Oh, god damn. How annoying that was. I should have just fought that battle. Ah, oh, that was dumb. But, oh well. Not much we can do about it now, is that? So, but I mean, we have... One, we have one, two, three, four, uh, four armies here ready to go and fight. So that's four armies we're going to send onto this peninsula now. That should be more than enough to clean them up. Plus, going to have very soon a new army. Got the cavalry there. We've got the archers. Just need the infantry, really, which we're training at Ambarakia. Yeah, we'll have a new army pretty soon as well. So that's going to be good. Anyway, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed that episode. We are being attacked literally on every single front apart from this, this one. So we've been attacked by the Ptolemies, Pergamon, Carthage, and Rome, and the Suebi all at once. Good lord. It's a lot to juggle, isn't there? Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please do like, please do subscribe, all that good stuff. It really helps the channel out. And I'll see you again on the next video.